Okay, I'm Natalie, and I did color changing sutures, and sutures are like stitches you put in after you have a procedure done at a hospital, if you don't know. Um, so I did, my testicle question was, is there a way to make sutures change color when there's infection? So a lot of things, they're creating a lot of um, antibiotic resistant bacteria due to like over prescription of antibiotics after surgical incisions and like procedures. And so what I was thinking is that if we could have the sutures change color, that they, you, then you like would stop over prescribing antibiotics then they're not needed or you could prescribe them when they are. So we tested pH and so we soaked the sutures in a pH indicator and then put them on, I do Staphylococcus epi as well, and then we put them on the plates to see if they would change color as the bacteria grew. And so we found that the like, color change wasn't super significant, but in one plate the sutures actually turned green and then the other ones they just lightened. So it, like showed a proof of concept that they actually work. And so this will help just like with infection in hospitals and that it can be like lessened and that hopefully it can be treated sooner and not lead to like blood staph infections and just be like a skin infection for a little bit and then be better. Um, and so having the pH indicator actually in the suture would help um, from having to do like invasive procedures to test and like to swap all the like incisions while they're still like healing and stuff which would reopen the wounds. So, yeah.